Say hi. Say so have a great day. See you later. Blow kiss. Ooh. Hi budget friends and welcome back to my channel. It is Mama Sila here and I am finally back from vacation. I just came back about three days ago from Texas and if you guys have been following me for a while, you know that I was planning on going on this trip because I was saving up for it. Um, if you are new to my channel, my name is Mama Sila. I have a 23 month old son. I just recently graduated college and um, I do take care of my dad. He has Parkinson's um, and yeah, so let me give you guys a little bit of an update. I have my notebook here and I have some family here as well. So I apologize for the noise, but this is my reality. I love to show you guys how it is, how my life is and i want to share more of my life with you guys um so if you are interested i have so many videos that i need to edit and upload on my personal channel so if you're interested in that it's called mama sila so it's mama sila minus the budgets on this channel okay so may was so hectic and i had to take a break and this vacation going to Texas was very needed for my mind, body, and soul. I actually had recorded a video yesterday and I am currently editing it, but then I decided I wanted to update my finances and update my cash envelopes and my sinking funds. So that is going to happen later on in this video as you see in the title. Um, but yeah, back to the updates. I know that our world is going through a lot right now and I just want to say that this is the wave to be on especially if we want to fight for justice and equal rights because we all know that people are privileged. Um, I graduated college in May. I do have to take an internship class in the fall and i might add a few extra classes just for the heck of it and just take the challenge i guess so that happened and i celebrated that with my family while i was on vacation we also celebrated the day that i graduated or that i was supposed to graduate but it was like a surprise thing my family did and i was super surprised and super grateful and blessed that they did that for me um it just really, I guess, made me feel really good about graduating. Another thing, an update, is that I've been furloughed from my job. And I'm not sure if I mentioned that in my previous budgeting videos. But um, I have been calling over a thousand times um, since I've been furloughed. <sighs> Sorry, I'm close the door. The kids are cleaning. Um, so just today actually is saturday and i called and i don't know what happened but they answered and then supposedly the lady was like oh this isn't the number to call because you are um like a special case because i'm a federal worker and then i kind of explained to her that there's a number that they gave me but they referred me to that number and so she just took my information down so i'm hoping that soon that they'll call me back and then i get that situated but i haven't been really i guess depending on that so i have been um, applying to jobs just because i took a vacation and so i'm not really sure how my etsy shops are gonna go if they're gonna go well um i just opened them back up um and i'm also going to have a new launch so that is in the works right now and hopefully i can um really hustle the next few days but i've been doing that um also yeah i've been applying to other jobs and like i said the releases i've also been recording a lot especially like on the vacation 
um, on my fitness journey I've been recording some videos and so hopefully I can edit those and put those on my personal channel so you guys can get to know me better and kind of get some tips on my fitness journey because I'm on a fitness journey and also I'll be talking about my son and his development over the past few months or weeks I guess because I just updated you guys about a month ago about his development um and the last thing i wanted to tell you guys is that i am in the process of moving so my family and i are looking and we are applying to places and there's this really nice home that we saw and i'm hoping that we get approved for it and that is why i was talking about looking for other jobs because yeah i have these side hustles and they have been doing well the the past three months honestly actually the past year they have been doing really well and i and you guys know that i just opened up a press on nail business in april but like i said i took a break and so i'm not sure if it's going to pick back up again or whatnot um i will leave the links down below if you guys are interested in anything budget or with press on nails i am actually wearing press on nails right now i'm wearing the short ones and i'm not quite sure if i like pretty much my whole update i hope you guys enjoy the rest of the video i will be updating my finances and also doing a cash envelope stuffing so let's just get right into it i've talked way too much and i hope you guys enjoy the rest of this video welcome back i already did my june budget we're gonna jump right into this so for my june budget we had made a total for this month of 714 dollars and this is from what i made in may but i don't get it until june and so the current money that i'm using right now is basically my money that I get from my businesses. I am currently furloughed from my current job. I'm also seeking other jobs and it sucks, but I have to do what I have to do for my family. So from my businesses, I got paid um, approximately $714 and this was for the month of May. For my bills and expenses, it is $363 for my wallet. I am giving myself $80 for everything. For sinking funds, it's going to get $78. And the remaining, I had put $80, but I totally forgot that I had some sinking funds that I needed to fill. So the remaining is going to be $2 left. I'm going to just put this aside. And I'm sorry if you see my son's cars. He is coming back and forth he is with me if you guys see him i hope you guys don't mind i also hope you don't mind that um cars is playing on in the background but he's not even playing with the cars he's playing with my old cash envelopes and my um little savings box thing to hold all of my sinking funds and cash envelopes but he's you but he's using the ones that don't have the money in them because he has lost a cash envelope of mine so i learned my lesson and he's just using the old ones right now if he's still doing it um after i do the stuffing then i'll go ahead and show you guys what he's doing we're gonna start with my cash dividers and my cash dividers i made and i sell them on my etsy shop many of you have bought them and i hope it's working really well for you if you are new um cash dividers have been such a game changer in the budget um, community and it's just a lot faster and easier to use in cash envelopes so let's get right into it so ethan he's going to get ten dollars five ten i will be getting ten dollars as well five ten um fun is going to get twenty and by the way, it is already the middle of the month and I have not stuffed my cash envelopes. I did have a few like 20s and things from last month in my envelope. So I just continued 
using it until I used it all up in Texas. I also had to pull a few um, 20s and stuff out of my cash envelopes of my sinking funds while I was in Texas. Um, especially for the trip, my travel cash envelope did not have enough. So I'll be talking about that in one of my future videos. Um, just to update you guys and let you guys know that May was such a trash month for me because so much was going on and I pushed my, um, I guess, finances aside, which I shouldn't have, um, but it happens. Gas is supposed to get, gas is supposed to get 25, but I just put $20 in today, so I'm just going to give it $5 and it should be enough for the rest of the month or more. Toiletries is going to get $10. Five ten, and lastly, laundry is going to get five dollars, and that is it for my cash envelopes. Next, we are going to bills, and bills is getting three hundred and sixty three dollars. So, one, two, we're gonna go ahead and use the 20s because I think I saved the 50 for tithe, so 100, 200. 20, 40, 60, 80, 100. So that's 300. 20, 40, 60. I need $3. 1, 2, 3. So this is for my next month's bills. I am a, I am a month ahead in my bills and expenses. Mama. Yes, Papa. I love you. Mama. You want to use your car? <laughs> Sit down. Sit down. Watch your head. Next we have Tithe and Tithe is getting $50. I should be putting 10% and 10% of $714 is $72. But I didn't have enough this time so $50 was all that I could have done. Amazon is getting six dollars, five, six, and I think I have to organize this. So we have five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen dollars now in our Amazon. Next, we have Google, and Google is getting $2. One, two. And I just paid off my Google Drive account. It is for space. And so now we are starting over. So we have $2 now. And last but not least, we have $20 for my car registration. We have 20, 40, 65, 75, 80, 81, 82, 83 dollars. And I don't think I have a flash card, but I will add one whenever I remember. But that is it for my video, everyone. In my next video, which I was supposed to post before this video, I'm going to be doing a giveaway. So just stay tuned for that. If you are not already subscribed, please subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell right next to it so you guys can be notified when that video uploads and so you can enter the giveaway. The rules will be on that video as well. And yeah, thank you all again so much for watching my cash envelope stuffing video. I hope you all are doing really well. I miss you guys and I can't wait to see what the rest of the year and actually this month has in store. So much is going on and I'm so excited and so blessed even though I'm a little bit stressed. 
I cannot be any more thankful for my businesses, for my family, for the connections I have made through my YouTube and through my Instagram. Mama. And yeah, I love you guys so much and I can never say it enough and I will continue to say it, but I just really want to spread so much positivity and love to you guys and show you guys my struggle and my journey with my current life right now with my little one. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye everyone. Bye.